Yo, what is up, guys? It's your boy Tatcher. Today, I'm bringing another video. Today, I'm actually going to be talking about the Season 1 playoffs that just went down in Columbus, Ohio this past weekend. We ended up getting second, but I'm going to give you guys a breakdown of how we got there and what happened while we were in Columbus. And it was um, it was definitely a good time, but it was very fucking cold. Don't want to go back, but sadly, I'm going back next week for regionals. So, hopefully, we can qualify, then I can get the fuck back to California. So, pretty much, I got there Thursday, and I traveled with Accuracy, part of Team Aware. And we got to um, the airport at about... We arrived there or landed in Columbus around like 7 p.m. And the denial owner picked us up, took us to the hotel, and I'm like, holy shit, it's cold, man. I, I can't do this. I can't do this. So then, I don't know why, but we decided to walk to Chipotle with the young god, Hugh, who is also on Team Aware. And so we walked there, ate Chipotle, and honestly, the Chipotle out there, um, it's like worse than the one in my town. Like, the one in where I live is so much better. Like, the chicken is just like way better over there it was like cr kind of crunchy and the chips tasted like uh they weren't that good it was weird but i guess it's just like different recipes or some shit but it was it was not that good over there kind of disappointing but you know what it's all good so after we got that chipotle we started walking back to the hotel about like two minutes into the walk because the walk from the chipotle to the hotel is like what five like five ten minutes all depends how fast you walk so we we're about two minutes into the walk and i'm like guys i don't know if i could do this like i have to start running and so I just started, I started jogging and I just kept jogging because I, it was way too cold for me. Like I couldn't handle it. So I jogged all the way pretty much to the hotel. It took about like three to five minutes. So I got there pretty quick. And then, um, it was, that was Thursday night. We started off on Friday. We were playing Team Envious, which is obviously the team that we made the trade against. Like it was for J-Cap Clacer got traded to Denial for Zoom and Saints. I went to Envy. And we ended up playing each other on Friday, the last match of the night, around like 10.30. And we started off really strong. We ended up uh, winning the hard point. I dropped like 43, and everyone else on my team dropped like 35 and above. So we started off really strong in Series 1-0. And then the next three maps, I don't know what happened. We just got shit on, I guess. Well, s &D was 6-4. Then the uh, uplink, we choked by like one point. We should have won that. And then we lost the CTF. We got raped on CTF Ascent. That's like one of our, that's probably our worst CTF map. So we got 3-1 by them. We're like, oh shit, man. We're going to lose bracket. We're gonna have to turn up tomorrow. And uh, yeah, we're gonna have to figure something out. Or we're just gonna get seven through eight to the tournament. I really did not want to get seven through eight because last year when I went with Rise for season three playoffs, I got seven through eight and it was terrible. I didn't get a play on Sunday. I lost early in the morning Saturday and there was just nothing to do with the whole event. Like so, I'm like, fuck no, guys. We're coming back. We are not getting seven through eight. We're gonna turn up, and uh, yeah, that's exactly what we did. So, we lost that match, woke up on Saturday, and we played Prophecy for our first match, and um, we came out hot. We 3 0 Prophecy, wait, was it 3-0? Yeah, I think we 3 0 Prophecy. So Optic Gaming played Aware, and Optic ended up beating them, sending them in the loser's bracket, then we played Aware on uh, the last match of the night on Saturday, and we uh, took the, no, we lost the first match. We actually got destroyed on Biolab Harmon. We got demolished. That's our worst problem, Biolab. So we got demolished by them. And then the second map, S and D. And obviously, like Aware has like TJ, Huke, Accuracy, Happy. So they're like a really good S and D squad. Like I'm like, we're like, oh crap, they're a really good S and D. We're gonna have to figure something out if we want to beat these guys. Cause we already went down, we already lost first map, so we're like, okay guys, we have to win this S and D or it's gonna be really bad. So we ended up clutching up and winning the S and D 6-4. Then it was the CTF retreat. And this was bad. So we had we had the lead with like 31 seconds left. It was like a stalemate. And uh, we were up 3-1 on second side, and uh, Cap had the flag, and we were all four set up around him. And Accuracy, like, somehow got by us and jumped, killed Cap, returned the flag while he did that. So their team got the Cap, and someone was on our point ready for the counter, so or the relay. So they killed Cap, returned the flag, got a Cap, and the other guy pulled the flag, and then he turned around and stunned us, so we were screwed. Then some guy ran up and, like, three-pieced us, and they tied it. And we're like, dude, what? what just happened like this this should not be happening this is not good we got to do something and we went to overtime got shit on they got like a 30 second cap so we're like oh my god and then we actually ended up getting um a cap or we didn't actually get a cap in overtime but we were literally like a second away half a second away from capping in like 31 seconds or something like that so we almost clutched up and won but we really messed up that map and we almost lost composure we're like dude what the fuck what just happened like this is not good this should not be happening and i'm like guys listen listen i'm taking over now and then i'm like we're gonna come back we're gonna win this series stay composed we're making it to the finals and then um 
Next map up in Detroit, we beat him like pretty convincingly, like nine to three or something like that. We uh, it was a pretty not easy game, but it was a pretty comfortable win. Like we knew we were gonna win the whole time through. And then the last map, SND was Riot. We ended up winning like six three or six four something like that. So we're like we all pumped. we were all pumped. That was really like a test of our team's composure. So we were like, okay guys, good shit, good shit. Now we have to bring it to tomorrow, bring the fire so we can make it to the final. Then we woke up on Sunday early. We played Phase, I think the first match of the day. So we played Phase. Beat them 3-1, and then we played the loser game of Optic Gaming and TK. So um, Optic and TK played each other. Optic Gaming went up two over them, and then um, TK ended up coming back and making it 2-2. And then they had like a 2-0 lead on the last map, but Optic brought it back to like a 4-2. Then TK made it or brought it to 5-5, and Optic Gaming, like, I think like Nate Jock called like a four mid push, and they all pushed middle and clutched up and beat TK. So we're like, okay. Um, TK is probably demoralized because they almost made the comeback, but they didn't. So we got this. We just got to keep working hard. Just play like we know how to play and we'll be fine. And so the first map was CTF Retreat versus TK. We had like a 60 point lead on the bar hill, like the last two hills of the game. Because we were like, we were beating him pretty convincingly on the, the whole map. And then um, someone called the play to just keep going for the time on the old hill instead of rotating to the next one. And that almost screwed us. They got all that time and then they got the top attic hill. So they were holding it. They almost came back. We ended up winning by like 10 because luckily we clutched up and somehow broke the hill like last second. It was really scary. Right as we won that map, I turned on like, what the fuck? Who, why the fuck would we go to the bar hill? That's literally the dumbest thing ever. Rotate. I was like freaking out. I'm like, dude, if we would have lost that, I probably would have cried. So we knew they were demoralized after that, after they almost made the comeback, we'll be clutched up. And then we ended up uh, beating them the next two maps. So we were on to the finals versus Optic Gaming. And we're like, good shit, guys. We made it all the way this far. We started in the loser's bracket, made the whole run. Now it's time to prove ourselves with Optic Gaming. And then we saw, we saw the map was um, uh, Hardpoint Biolab, and we're like, guys, well, it was a good run. So yeah, we played the Biolab. And uh, we got pretty much destroyed because that's our worst hop map. We got to find something to like help us because uh, we got shit on earlier in the tournament as well on that map. And then we were playing the SND Riot and we were down 04. And we're like, guys, we got to figure something out because uh, none of this shit's working. And then Cap's like, oh, I'm just going to start running around. So we all started running around, went up 5 4, and then they, they clutched up 1 2 rounds and took that map. So it was a 6 5 map count. And then it was the third map, CTF Ascend. And we're like, guys, just do our best. Um, this isn't our map either. We got destroyed by Envy on this earlier, but uh, we got this, like, just saying delusionally confident stuff. And we ended up getting railed on that map too. So, pretty much played our two worst maps in finals. Not gonna blame that, but now we know what we need to work on, especially those two maps, because uh, I don't want to get destroyed like that again. So we ended up getting 3-0 in finals by Optic Gaming, which was not, like, we definitely could have had a better series if we had different maps, but, uh, you know, stuff happens. Can't always have, like, the maps you want, but, you know. It's all good. So we ended up getting second at Columbus. We still got like, what, 3,750 bucks. And I don't know how many pro points, but a, probably a pretty good amount for placing second because, because it was a 25K, I believe. We're going back to Columbus, Ohio next week for regionals. I think we all leave on Thursday. And then uh, we played, I think we have to win two matches to qualify. And then uh, the top four teams at that event get uh, like a little bit of money. And I don't know if they get pro points or not. But uh, yeah, so that's the plan for the next week. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. My name is Attach and I'm out. Peace.